Hey guys, what is going on? Um, as you can see, it is nice and sunny out, which means I should be riding. My phone said today was supposed to be cloudy and rainy, but it's not. But I figured this, I would take this time and talk about my camera setup on my helmet. And what I tried doing uh, with this, and I'll get to that in a little bit, but this right here was pretty much my current uh, camera setup GoPro 10 media pod um, I have this this little boom arm that you see behind the wires got that off Amazon pretty cheap it was like 12 bucks and then this purple panda lavalier mic um, this is what I had been using up until my last video when I switched to this and then I had a little had some technical difficulties out of that setup you can see right here I got the Rick rack the Purple Panda Lavalier mic you get off Amazon. And all I did with it was took my cheek pad out right here on the side, just popped out this one little rivet, and pretty much just ran this. Had a little bit more slack, but just pretty much ran it in there and stuck it out the side. So yeah, I would just run this when I had a little bit more slack. There we go. I'll run this in here just like that. Then I will put that snap uh, back in place with that mic sticking out. Pretty much just like that, right? And that's how my mic worked. And all the videos I did with it like that, it worked great. Um, I wanted to clean up these wires here because I think they look ugly. And so that's why I went and bought this, this wireless DJI lapel mic system, which I really like, okay? I, I have nothing negative to say about it. I just need to troubleshoot with a little bit more. Now, you do need the MediaPod if you're gonna run a lapel mic directly into your GoPro, because your GoPro 10 only has you know one plug for your charge and your mic and with this you can plug into the audio jack and feed audio directly into it plus if you need to you can run a USB-C cord right here into the back of it and uh, you can have continuous power also so you have three plugins up here I'm not sure what this top one is it's a uh, looks like a micro maybe but if you're running a lapel mic, um, you do need, if you're running this purple panda mic, you do need this little adapter that they bring. Because if you notice on the adapter, it has two black lines or three gold segments. And on the lapel mic, it has three black lines or four segments. For whatever reason, you can't plug the lapel mic directly into the GoPro MediaPod. It won't work. You have to plug it into one of these uh, three-segmented audio jacks, which this came with the Purple Panda kit. So out of the box, um, you'll be able to plug this into the MediaPod for the GoPro 10. So that is, real quick, my current helmet setup. And like I said, I'll put link in the description for this Amazon thing. Super easy to find. I like it. I was kind of concerned to be a little, uh, I was kind of concerned it would move. I can't even plug this in one hand. I was kind of concerned that this would move while riding, but it doesn't. Once you tighten everything down, it stays. Um, this is loose right now just for me loosening that. Um, but the reason why I had to go with this is because if you notice right there in that chin bar, it's not really a flat surface that I can put one of these um, GoPro mounts stuck onto my helmet. So that's why I had to go to the side. I will say with my setup and with it running into the cheek over here, like I had it, I can't raise and lower my chin bar. And this is a modular helmet, okay? So when I have this running over here to this, yeah, I can't raise and lower that because 
my cord is too tight and I don't want my cord so loose that it's flapping while I'm riding. Um, this mic over here is to the Cardo. So that's what that goes to. I haven't figured out a way to use the Cardo mic. Um, I'm not sure if there, I don't really think there is a way. But the solution I have is using these. These are just little zip tie stickers. This is a half an inch. This is an inch. This one may be a little too small, but what I thought about doing was peeling this off and sticking this on the inside on the little flat surface, uh, like, like right here of my, of my uh, chin bar. Let me stick this right there. I thought about sticking it like right there on my chin bar and then running the mic to it because then this cord would be just in here like that. And then I could raise and lower my chin bar as needed. So that's probably what I'm going to go to if I can't get this working. So I'm going to do another video right now on this, the DJI wireless lapel mic. I'm going to talk to you about my process of why I bought it, how I had it set up on here, and my initial problems I ran into.